Hey everyone, it is Mona here at Craft Clash. Today we are making dandelion paperweights. A number of you have asked me to do this and I promise that if I found a perfect dandelion and it wasn't too late this season that I would do it. And I found a couple, so we're going to make them. So what I have here are these little ice maker balls. If you saw my vacation memory ball, you'll see that I used them in there. And I'll have a link to them in the description below. But I am just going to be using the bottoms this time because we're just doing a paperweight. And I have used this paperweight mold before as well. This is the plastic one and it is quite a bit bigger. So if you wanted a bigger paperweight, you could go with this one. Otherwise, um, this should work fine. So here are my dandelions and I believe they will fit in here just fine. And these molds have a nice shiny finish on the inside so that means our paperweights will come out nice and shiny. I've mixed three ounces of the Easy Cast Resin and here are my molds. I'm going to give it a minute and let these bubbles rise to the top. Son of a gun. Alright, I just ruined my one dandelion but we're going to forge forward with it anyway. So I guess this is a good one to experiment with. So I'm going to press it in just like this. Cut the stem. I'm going to take a couple popsicle sticks to hold the stem just like that and put it aside. Now let's see if I could do better with this one. I'm going to take it, press it in slowly, slowly. Now we're going to let these sit for 12 hours. These have set for about 12 hours. Now I'm just going to snip off the ends. I have some more resin mixed and I'm just going to top them off so everything's embedded. Then we're going to let them cure for a minimum of 12 hours. We can come and hit any bubbles. Now it's time to unmold our dandelions. Here are the dandelion paperweights. Here's the first one. And you can kind of see that the seeds had dispersed and that was the one that I ruined. So that was all on me. And I did get a bunch of micro bubbles on this one for some reason. And then here's the other one that turned out pretty nice, I think. Here's the bottom. There's the side, there's the top. Now I did get some bubbles stuck in there, kind of big ones. So that was surprisingly easy. Had I known it was that easy, I'd have probably done it years ago. Be sure to let me know what you think of the dandelion paperweights in the comments below. Thank you guys for being here every week. And if you haven't yet, remember to subscribe so you don't miss a thing. I'll definitely see you next time. In the meantime, remember, life's too short not to shimmer, so grab your glue gun and your glitter. Stay safe.